Hey everyone, it's John Reed, author of 50 Things to See with a Telescope. Welcome to the first video in the Homeschool Astronomy Challenge series where we'll explore the night sky one very simple challenge at a time. This is Learn to Stargaze. Tonight's challenge is identifying the Big Dipper, which also goes by the plow, the wagon, and many other names in numerous cultures. It is the most famous star pattern in the sky. But first, not everyone on Earth can see the Big Dipper. Why? Because unless you can stargaze from the equator, there are stars that you cannot see, regardless of the season or time of night. The Big Dipper is best viewed by those living north of the equator. Sorry, Tasmania, no Big Dipper for you, but enjoy the Southern Cross. For those of us living up here in the north, in Hoth, I mean the northern USA, or Canada, or Europe, or Russia, the Big Dipper never sets. That's because we're close enough to the North Pole that some stars don't get blocked by the Earth. We say that these stars are circumpolar. Okay, so how do you find the Big Dipper? Quite simply, look north-ish. No telescope required. From hour to hour and month to month, the Big Dipper appears to rotate around what's called the North Celestial Pole, something we'll learn about in the next video. The Big Dipper is huge, consisting of four stars in the cup and three in the handle. The Big Dipper is an asterism, which means it's a star pattern, not an official constellation. The constellation is Ursa Major, the Great Bear. If you're following along in the 50 things to see with a telescope activity workbook, this target is found on page 21. To complete the challenge, use a pencil to trace out the Big Dipper, then go out and see it for real. Check the box to record your observation. As you observe the other stars in Ursa Major, check that off your list as well. It's important to identify the Big Dipper because in stargazing, it's used as a signpost that points us to other targets, like the North Star, which we'll discuss in the next video. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe so you don't miss the next challenge. And remember, the future is looking up. <laughs>